Speak Indo podcast is a medium to think about life while learning about the Indonesian language and culture. Hi, I'm Natasha, the host of Speak Indo podcast. The first part of the story will be narrated in the Indonesian language. The second part will be in English. The transcript is available on our blog, speakindo.life, and our YouTube, Speak Indo channel. Season 3, Episode A3 The First Culture Shock Satu malam, saat awal kuliah di Amerika, saya diundang ke pesta teman yang tinggal di satu gedung asrama. Mulai pestanya jam 8. Saat saya datang, sudah mulai ramai, dan semua orang memegang gelas minum plastik berwarna merah. Yang saya kaget, Tidak ada makanan sama sekali. Ada satu mangkok isinya kacang. Satu mangkok lagi isinya keripik kentang yang hampir habis. Saya lupa kalau pesta di Amerika itu tidak sama dengan di Indonesia. Di Indonesia, acara pesta besar dan kecil, acara rapat, bahkan acara kematian, makanan pasti akan tersedia. Dan menunya bisa lengkap kadang bisa bawa pulang makanan sisa. Makanan utama seperti bubur ayam, bakmi ayam, nasi goreng, dan lain-lain. Saya senang sekali bertemu teman baru di pesta teman asrama saya. Walaupun baru kali ini saya pulang pesta kelaparan. Akhirnya, saya bikin mie instan dan telur jam 1 malam. The next one will be the English version of the story. One night, during my early university days in America, I was invited to a friend's party who also lived in the same dormitory. The party started at 8 p.m. When I arrived, it was already crowded and many people were holding a red plastic cup. What surprised me was that there was no food at all. There was a bowl of peanuts. Another bowl had potato chips that were almost finished. I forgot that in America, parties are not the same as those in Indonesia. In Indonesia, whether it is a big or small party, a meeting, or even a wake, there will always be food available. And it can consist of a complete menu. Sometimes, you can even doggy bag the leftovers. Main dishes such as chicken porridge, chicken noodles, fried rice, and many others. I was very happy meeting new friends at the party of my dorm friend. Even though that was the first time I came home hungry from a party. In the end, I cooked instant noodles and eggs at 1 a.m. As this is one of our additions, as we are still in the midst of the COVID-19 pandemic, we'd like to extend our deep condolences to those who have lost their loved ones. This is definitely a very difficult time for everyone, and we can only hope that soon we can all heal as nature flourishes. Probably one day when we look back, we learn that how valuable is the time that we have to hug our loved ones, to be kind to our fellow humans, and to thank the sun for shining upon us. I'm Natasha, your host of Speak Indo podcast, and we would like to thank our guest speakers for sharing their story. If you like the story, please share it with your friends and family. The transcript of the story is available at our blog, speakindo.life, and our YouTube, Speak Indo channel. You can subscribe to our channel so that you won't miss any upcoming episodes. These are our stories. What is yours?